Hi everyone, this is Melanie from Living Luxuriously for Less and today we are organizing my closet. Now I don't know if I'm going to show you guys this before or not because it is a hot, hideous, hideous mess. And I have already gone in between the shelves, if you can see here, and taken those things out, but it is just a lot. It's, it's overwhelming. Over here is where I keep all of my support wear and jewelry and scarves and all of that good stuff, tights and my pantyhose and belts and just different uh, cardigans and uh, you know different shirts that I wear underneath my suits, camisoles, workout clothes, shoes. It's a mess. I'm embarrassed. So. I am, this is my second spring cleaning project and I'm going to get started on this. I've given myself two hours to get this completed. I did enlist the help of two teenage girls. So hopefully this is going to, you know, work out within my two hour um, span, but we will see. So stay tuned to see what I come up with next. Right, so here is the view when you walk into um, my closet. And so what I did was up here, I have all my shoes. I stored them in the Dollar Tree shoe bins and I purchased these a couple of years ago um, to organize all of my shoes so that I could easily see them. Now I used to categorize them by color and by style and I used to have a picture on the front and label it and every time I changed shoes I found myself having to redo that process and this makes it so much easier. I can see exactly what I'm looking for and it really works. And so I purchased those a few years ago. Um, they don't make those like that and sell them at the Dollar Tree anymore, but I do see them at Dollar General. Um, these were a dollar and I, you know, bought like 10 a week until I got all my shoes replaced. And it was a great investment because I'm still using them all these years later. Now up top, I have all of my dress clothes, my suits and you know, things of that nature. And I have them color coordinated and I chose to go with the clear hangers um, with that because when you have skirts, it's with pants, um, a little bit easier, but I'll show you what I mean in just a moment when I show you the bottom because I was using a velvet hangers, but it made it a little bit more difficult to hang my skirts and things of that nature. So I'm going to find an alternative, but right now I'm just going to stick with the clear hangers and they're all the same colors and it makes it look, you know, really uniform. And like I said, I categorize them and I hope you guys are not getting this glare, but there's a light in the top of my closet. And so anyway, I categorize them by color. Here on the bottom are the velvet hangers that we discussed and they are gray and I have all of my pants and shirts, you know, um, hung and this is all my casual items that I have hung here and it's summer and winter because I don't like changing out. I used to do that. I don't do that anymore. And so I try to just categorize them by long and short sleeve. I do all the short first and then all the long and then I put them together. Um, by the color and then I have all my pants here and then underneath there are some more shoes you guys I have a lot of shoes now over here I am a jumpsuit fanatic and again I use the clear hangers and this looks a little bit ragged here but I promise you it looks really neat in person but um I have all my jumpsuits here so these are the short ones which are called play suits and these are the longer ones which are jumpsuits and so i have all of those here and back behind that i have more even more shoes and i know where each section is like right now all of my summer shoes are over here at the bottom of this and right here where i can easily locate them and the areas you don't see is where i put my boots okay up here is where i keep my uggs and that's like a little grade um automatic scent that i have up here but that's why I keep my Uggs and all of my jeans. And I love Miss Me jeans, so they are probably the only style that fits me really well. So I have quite a collection here that I've, um, you know, kind of acquired over, over the years. But those are all my jeans there, and all of my Uggs are over there in my cleaning kit. And on this side of my closet, I have baskets and I displayed you know some of my favorite shoes I'm gonna get something else to put them on right now but that, that it's more uniform but I'm gonna use the box that came in for now but that is where I keep like my jewelry my support wear 
my socks and footies, um, fashion clips that I use on my clothing or in my hair. This is where I, I um, all of my nude nylons, and these are all of my multicolored um, nylons and tights, and all of my cardigans and camisoles, and here's another pair of Ugg boots on the bottom. And then I have all my belts there, and um, a pair of shoes, just like I said, um, I'm going to make it look, I'm trying to make it look kind of like boutique-ish. So as I'm doing this, I'm going through and getting rid of my clothing as well, because I wanted a little bit more airy than I have right now, but it is organized. And I just wanted to show you guys a very budget friendly way to organize your closet and not have to spend, you know, a whole lot of money on, you know, the different things to organize. For example, I purchased these baskets at Hobby Lobby and they were like, you know 90% off last year and they were all pink I love the color pink so my closet is going to be pink and gray and maybe navy blue and so I'm going to and so I'm going to just kind of tidy all of that up to keep it more uniform and overall you know more boutique-ish and you know I'm getting rid of clothes as I go to make it a little bit more airy and so I just wanted to show you guys this. I hope you enjoyed it. And if you have any questions about, you know, any of the items that I got or my total cost, please feel free to leave a comment in the box below. And if you'd like to see more of my clean um, spring cleaning projects, make sure you leave it in the comment box below. And until next time, it's Melly with Living Luxuriously for Less. Bye-bye.